How's it going everyone, the Savage Eater. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys my list for the top 3 MCPE survival servers for 1.17.40 and above. So yeah, with that being said, let's hop right into today's video. But before we do that, be sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, I'm going to be doing this video on mobile today instead of PC because I can't get on PC today. Um, so yeah, let's get right into today's video. So guys, if you are on Java, then I have good news for you because two of these servers on this list are crossplay. You can play from Java Edition and Bedrock Edition. So the server name for our number three spot is Olympus SMP. So you can put anything for the server name. I just put Olympus. The server address is played at olympussmp.tk and the port is 8000. Now let's go ahead and join the server. It does work on 1.17.40 on Bedrock Edition. So yeah. And I believe the latest version on Java Edition. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't know. All right, so first thing you guys want to start off with is uh, just take a look at all of these stuff. What you guys want to do first is to look at the rules so you guys don't get banned. Just do slash rules in chat. And uh, here's their official Discord over here. They have the wilderness. You can just click here to start your journey. Now, the reason this is in my number three spot and not in my number two or number one is because of the lack of players. And you guys know I don't really like servers with a little bit of players. So right here, um, click to start your journey. Just click it and it'll uh, teleport you somewhere random in the wilderness. Now, my server isn't going to be on this list because it's not updated right now. Now, we're working on updating it, but it's not updated right now. So over here, we have a bunch of different uh, staff that work on the server. Shout out to all of them and uh yeah i think that's about it honestly i think they have chess shops as well i don't think they have the normal shop you have to buy and sell with other players i believe that's how that works um then we have the person that built the spawn right here which is pretty insane now it says crates this way you just come over here and you can take a look at all of the crates i think they probably have a vote crate so you can yeah they have a vote crate where you can uh vote for different crates oh here we have the weekly crate and the daily crate so it's actually pretty cool in my opinion so um yeah if you guys want to go to the wilderness, just do slash RTP in chat. Slash RTP, just like that. And just wait five seconds, don't move. And boom, there you are. You are teleported. Now, in this version, they have uh, they are 1.17 servers, so they have the caves and cliffs update and all that good stuff. Um, I think they have custom generation because the blocks look a little bit different than normal generation, but it's still pretty cool because they have all of the latest features on the server, which is pretty cool. And then they have different level mobs. We have the level one cows, a bunch of different level mobs right here, guys. As you can see, the level one sheep, you guys can go ahead and kill. And uh, maybe there's different level like um, zombies and stuff like that. It'll be pretty hard to beat. But um, I'm not sure about all that. I think we're going to head up to our number two spot. And uh, yeah, with that being said, let's hop into our number two spot. Which for my number two spot, I have a featured server. You guys probably aren't going to like this server. But the server is Lifeboat Survival. Now, the only reason this is in my number two spot is because it has tons of players. And you can never go wrong with Lifeboat Survival. So let's go ahead and join the server. But yeah, some of you guys may not like this server. Some of you guys may like it. It's not a advanced survival server. It's just like normal pre 1.17 survival server it's like that it doesn't have all the netherite and all that crazy stuff so if you want a simple survival server lifeboat is for you so once you join their server you just want to look for the survival server right here somewhere i'm not sure where it's at but uh they do have it somewhere over here survival mode right here i missed it completely all right so just click it boom and here we are so yeah it's just a pretty cool survival server um they reset like every couple of days so you can't get too crazy advanced on here they reset like every week i think um so spawn won't get too griefed and stuff like look at this server look how many people are in it look at all these people then there's other servers that have even more players like they have multiple survival servers you guys can play on. you can play on the newer ones that just reset or the ones that are like later more advanced into the game like this one i could tell this one has been around for a while i think it do like slash time or something in the chat server time right here server time three days so they're gonna restart the server in three days so um, like if you want to come on here and you just wanted to like speed run it then this will probably be the one to speed run before re the reset the reset um and yeah i think that's about it for lifeboat survival if you guys do like a simple survival server then lifeboat is for you they have multiple servers you guys can choose from they have pre 1.17 features and uh, it's just really cool so i don't think they have the nether either so yeah i hope you guys do enjoy this server i think i'm gonna go ahead and hop to our number one spot which is 
probably one of the best crossplay servers I've ever seen. So let's go ahead and hop into our number one server. All right, boys, for my number one survival server, I have KiwiSMP.fun. Now you can join this on Java Edition. The server address is just KiwiSMP.fun, I believe. Let me know if that works. But the server name for Bedrock Edition is Kiwi, or you can put anything for that. The port is 19132, and let's go ahead and join the server. It has tons of players. It has 214 players online right now. They have a bunch of different game modes to choose from, not only survival, but I'm gonna be showing up the survival in this video. So we're loading in just like that, and uh, yeah, they have a bunch of different uh, things this morning you guys can read, but um, yeah, this is the server with Squid Game. This server has Squid Game, you guys can play on there if you want. Um, they have Earth SMP, but the one we're gonna take a look at is Survival SMP. I honestly think the Earth SMP one is better, but yeah, let's show the Earth SMP one off. Uh, off. I haven't seen it yet, so let's go to take a look at it for the first time. They have multiple Earth SMP servers right here, guys, multiple. All right, I'm gonna go to the one with 58 players right here. Now, I think this is the more fun one rather than the regular uh, survival SMP. So here we are in spawn. Guys, I don't know all the features of this server because I'm kind of new to it, but uh, they do have a, a lot of cool features on here, guys. So, um, yeah, they have a bunch of different shops. I think you guys have to buy and sell with like players. I think this is like a player shop you guys can buy from right here with all the villagers and stuff so that's actually pretty cool they have a pretty nice economy on here which i think is pretty neato and uh yeah you guys can check that out for yourself they have a bunch of different stuff over here we have the freaking i don't know what this says ball ballo shop i don't know but uh this is actually pretty creative like look at this knit co shop bro look at this, this is so creative but yeah, you could join this on bedrock edition or java edition whatever you guys want to do i believe they have clans as well slash clan and yeah you can look at the whole clan menu which looks pretty insane honestly they have uh the name they have the free agent i'm not sure what that is i think you click that to create a clan they have the leaderboard they have the clan list they have the reset kdr they have select your language and they have other commands right there it's actually pretty dope and uh yeah i think that's about it for this server honestly because i don't know all the features of this server i just know it's really fun they are uh, 1.17 and above and they get tons of players on here guys and i think it's also the earth SMP. i think the server is shaped like um yeah it's shaped like um the actual earth so as you guys can see right here on the uh scoreboard on the side it says gps we're in africa right now um and i think they also have a shop like a uh, map you guys can look at but I'm not sure what the website is for that. So there's also a map you guys can look at if you want to. Which is pretty dope. Um, over here we have a couple of different people. We have Emma. We have Zach. Which are traders and stuff like that. Which looks pretty cool. Pretty decent. Pretty nice. Um, so yeah, it's pretty simple uh, stuff on the server. Honestly, I think it's one of the best uh, Earth SMP crossplay servers I've ever seen. To be honest, I played a couple of Earth SMPs, and I think this one would probably be the best because it's crossplay. You can play with Java Edition players, and you can play with Bedrock Edition players, which is pretty insane. Guys, my video unexpectedly cut off there, um, so there wasn't much more to show. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and end the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, if you want more videos like this, then uh, like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, and yeah, bye bye.